Hi, in this video, I want to implement an interstitial add to an Android Studio project. I want to implement the full screen add when we want to exit from one activity and go back to the main activity. This is my project I already created. As you can see, this is main activity. And I wrote uh, main activity at the center to recognize it easily. There is one button. When I click on the button, it goes to second activity. And when I click on the back, I want to show an interstitial ad. And when we close the interstitial ad, it goes back to the main activity. So this is the project I already created, as you can see. This is my main activity. There is a text view, which I wrote main activity. And this is the button I implemented here. In main activity Java, I initialize the button and I set on click listener for the button. And with the uh, intent method, I open the second activity. This is my second activity. There is only one text view here, which is written second activity. In the second activity Java, it still is blank and I didn't implement anything. So for the beginning, I go to add mob instruction. I go to get started. And as you know, we should make sure that Google is refreshed correctly in project level of build graded file. So I go to Android Studio. This is the project level of build graded file. I open it. And as you can see, the Google is here in all projects repositories. So I close the build grader file. Then I have to copy and paste this implementation into app level of build grader file dependencies. So I copy this, go back to Android Studio. This is the app level of build grader file. I open it. This is the dependency. And I'm coming here and paste it at the bottom. And I sync the project. Then I have to copy and paste this uh, metadata tag into Android uh, manifest file. As you know, for testing, we always using the sample uh, uh, app ID and sample uh, add unit uh, ID. So I copy this one. I'm coming here, click on the icon, and paste it here, press enter. Then I copy the tag, go to the Android Studio, go to Android Manifest. I go to the bottom of uh, application tag and paste it here. I always suggest you to set the hardware accelerated to true to show the video ad correctly. Also, we should not forget to add user permission for the internet. Like this. Okay, I go back to uh, Add mob instruction. And now it's time to initialize the add mob SDK. So I have to go to my activity on create method and copy and paste these lines over there to initialize the SDK. So I want to show the full screen add into second activity. So I go to second activity Java into on create method. And I'm going to initialize the SDK here. To import the required classes, I'm using Alt and Enter. And import all the required classes. Like this. Also, there is one suggestion here. I'm using Alt and Enter to implement the suggestion. Like this. As you can see, there is one error. I'm just removing this one. Again, 
alt and enter and import the required classes like this then I don't need this class anymore and I remove it like this okay our SDK is initialized and it's time to go to inter interstitial instruction first of all I have to uh, declare an interstitial add so I copy this line I go to second activity class and declare it here I'm using alt and enter then I have to create an add request and load the interstitial add so I copy all these lines I go to the Android studio and here I create a new method I'm just uh, typing load add like this and then to create this method I'm using alt and enter to create this method in second activity class like this and I paste all those codes here again I'm using alt and enter like this alt and enter alt and enter again alt and enter and here we can we can add the tag or we can create a tag private final string tag gonna be add more like this okay as you can see we built our add request and uh, we loaded an interstitial add I don't need this comment I'm gonna remove them and it's time to set our callback so we go down and I copy these lines after I load the interstitial add successfully I will set the callback so I'm coming here and paste these codes here for the callback and by alt and enter I'm importing the required classes also I can copy and paste this uh, non-null tag here to remove the suggestion like this I'm gonna remove these comments perfect okay as you can see we initialize the SDK, we build our add request, and we load an interstitial add. Now it's time to show the advertise. So I'm coming at the bottom of the uh, second activity uh, class, and here I'm writing finish. As you can see, there is a method here which is called finish. I select this one. Now, to show the app, I have to copy and paste this code into finish method I just created. So I copy this one, I go to the Android Studio, to the finish, I'm coming here, and paste it here. So, if the if uh, the ad is loaded we're gonna show the ad 
otherwise we're gonna finish this activity so simple i saw in many videos and many websites instead of finish they're using on back press method i don't suggest on back press method because sometimes you have some uh, a fragment or some activity which when you click on back press it needs to undo or redo the activity or fragment and uh, if you use a uh, on back press uh, method instead of finish every time you uh, press the back bottom of of your device the ad will be activated and triggered but by this way you can use your uh, undo method or whatever and only when you want to close the uh, activity uh, this finish method will be activated and show the insertation so i strongly suggest you to use finish method instead of on back press method okay i close uh, this line and uh, here when we uh, dismiss the full screen ad we need to call the finish method like this so the idea is like this when we open the activity is loading an interstitial ad so when we want to close the uh, activity it's calling this finish method in the finish method the ad is loaded so this part of the condition will be uh, chosen and showing the interstitial ad but when you the, watch the ad and dismiss the ad and close the ad again it's calling this method the finish method but this time there is no ad to uh, to show an m interstitial ad is not so for second time uh, this part of condition will be run and it's finishing the activity okay let's try it Okay, this is our app. I'll go to second second activity. Ad is loaded, as you can see. Now I press the uh, back button. As you can see, it's showing the ad. I close it. When I close it, it goes to main activity. Let me try it again. It's, it's loaded the ad. Back. Close. Perfect. As you can see, it's very easy to implement an interstitial ad when you want to exit from an activity and go back to previous one. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed this video. Please don't forget to leave a like and subscribe for more videos. Thank you.